Welcome to our video on how to create a parameterized report. In this video, we will show the following. How to create a new report, add data, add a list, add parameterized filters, and run the report. You can add prompts to a report to add interactivity for users. Prompts act as questions that help users to customize the information in a report to suit their own needs. For example, you can create a prompt so that users can select a product type. Only products belonging to the selected product type are retrieved and shown in the report. IBM Connell's Analytics automatically generates prompted reports based on the parameters you create in your queries. When you run the report, Cognos Analytics generates a prompt page for these parameters. To create a parameterized report, click New and select Report. Select the one column template, the blue theme, and click OK. To add data, click Add Report Data and navigate to Team Content, Samples, Data, Sample Data Module, and click Open. Now we are going to add a list. Click the plus icon in the center of the report and select List. Accept the defaults in the resulting dialog and click OK. Now we will populate the list with data. Open the Data Module and double click Product Line to add it to the list, Product Type, Quantity, Revenue, and planned revenue. Now we will create a parameter. Select any cell in the list, click the filters icon in the toolbar, and select edit filters. In the resulting dialog, click add, select advanced, and click OK. In the detail filter expression editor, we'll create the following expression. To specify the data item to use for the prompt, from the source tab, Double-click Product Line to add it to the Expression Definition box. Type The best practice is to name your parameters like this, P Product Line for Single Select and P Product Lines for Multi Select. Prompt expressions use the following syntax, where P represents the parameter name. For a single select prompt, data item equals question mark p question mark and for a multi select prompt instead of the equals we'll use data item in question mark p question mark when we're finished creating our expression we can click ok and then we'll click the add icon to add another one click advanced click ok this time we'll double click product type and we'll type and click OK. Finally, we'll add one more. And click OK. And click OK. We can also view our new parameters within the query itself by clicking Queries and selecting Query 1. And here are the three filters that we just created. We can also create a new parameter here on this screen by opening up the data panel and dragging Retailer Country into the Detail Filters box. To preview the report, click Run Options and select Run HTML. A prompt page is generated for us and we can select some values and click OK. And there's our report. Thank you for watching this video on how to create a parameterized report. Please comment on this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel to learn more about using IBM Cognos Analytics 11.